You better finish it. Nice. Welcome to Burrito Quest, everyone. Yeah. Ben Ugh, missed badass. the horrible gobbler the last time. If you remember, our uh, our ratings were pretty much unanimously that it was a steaming horrible. pile of shit. Yeah. Um, Ben's doing the Green Mile and the Gobbler in the same night. Uh -huh. Yeah. So. How's oh. that gobbler, Ben? <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. This is, um... <laughs> Come on, spit it out. The no, I mean, don't spit it out. <laughs> this is a testament to shitty burritos. It's... I'm glad you're having to eat it on a night when you wanted to do two. <laughs> uh, it's painful, isn't it? It's actually like, you get about halfway through it and you just want to stop. We're joined again by Amy. Oh, yeah. Amy got a, uh, Hi, some Amy. kind of sausage breakfast burrito. Hello. I wish I had a sausage breakfast burrito. You want some of my salsa? Mm -hmm. That salsa is pretty... Yeah, salsa's weird, too. It's really light-colored and really hot. Yeah. But this oh. burrito's spicy, so... All right, Green Mile. So green Ben's mile. getting ready to go on his Green Mile. Oh. Burrito 2 for the night. Doesn't He's having hurt? a little bit of trouble. Can get a napkin? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. You can have all of them, dude. You're in there. So, uh, the green mile has, um, the green chili pork, which is done out of a bin, but I mean, it's one of their standard kind of burrito stuff. How is it? Is it pretty so, good? Yeah, it's pretty spicy. The green chili pork, uh, cheese, beans, and pico de gallo. I think you got double spice going on. The pico's actually a little spicy, and so is the, uh, green chili pork. Mine's busting out both ends over here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mine is, uh, also okay. the structural integrity. I gotta admit, I can't yeah. taste it. You can't taste it from all the salt you ate on the gobbler. Yeah, so. I don't mind this too much. Um, this is pretty hot. I'm digging it. I like it. I think the green chili pork is extremely disappointing. You just ate a gobbler, dude. I would think that you'd think it'd be delicious. <laughs> it's, a is, little, it's a little bit salty. This just tastes like, basically, your standard... Bean burrito? Bean... Spicy bean burrito. Mm -hmm. mm hmm. Well, I got some big chunks of jalapeno from the pico. Right. So. I mean, I'm wishing this was beef instead of pork. Because then it would be tastier. Mm -hmm. I think you have a, some kind of death wish on the pork products, Ben. I wonder why that is. I don't know. It could also be that it's not very good. Mr. Glickley. Well, that, that could also be true. I'm sticking to my theory. I'm sticking to it. Oh, come here, burrito. Come here. This is what I know. Oh, that gobbler is wretched. <laughs> Worst burrito I've ever had. Yeah. It looked really nice. Yeah, it was colorful. It was attractive. I'm telling you, dude, all those veggies expressed water out in your burrito and just dumped that crap all over your... I wrung it out like a dish towel. <laughs> so, so it wasn't it wasn't just an accident that he poured salt all over our gobblers. Mm. He did it again to Ben's. I think they do it on every burrito. I think most burritos that they throw on the <laughs> grill, they put salt on them. I think it's probably a salt and pepper mix, but... Well, he poured it on them. Yeah, yeah. He did it on bins. Same thing. Mr. I don't know who that guy who started Santa Fe Grill. So far, the gobbler is your worst burrito. Yeah. And this is why. If we ever give this to you, understand that. This is now five people that's had the gobbler. And it's wretchedly awful. Yeah, they put so much salt. You know, my uh, sausage and egg burrito is full of pepper. See, you can see black pepper? Yeah, like black pepper. Maybe it was left on the grill from when he made the gobbler. Yeah, it could be just Ew. in the sausage mix that they have, too. Oh. I've, I've had their sausage burritos, like, all the time. And it's not and pepper? it's not. Huh. Well, all Very right, strange. so... This green mile's a little messy. It is. <laughs> Indeed. It's kind of indistinct. It's messy, Ben. That's what I said. It's kind of indistinct. <laughs> Are you opposing it's a little what messy. I said? I'm not making a mess. I mean, my perspective is green, uh, green mile versus gobbler. No, oh, yeah, which one wins? Well, I mean, the gobbler was very messy. <laughs> well, I just started the green mile, but yes, the. <laughs> mm. So, um, yeah, we didn't have burritos in like, well, it's been over a week, huh? Mm hmm. Like a week and a half because we went off to Gen Con. I can taste every grain of salt in this thing. It's like the gobbler is some sort of Lovecraftian monster that opened my eyes. <laughs> my I can't buds, unsee. It, it can taste forever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Mm, I'm having to lick it off the paper. What have I done? I don't know, dude. Uh, you did it to yourself. You didn't have to do it. No, I don't know. So watch out night. for later in the night because the gobbler actually made me physically ill. <laughs> like, did you throw up? Was, yeah, I did. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, it was the first puke of Burrito Quest. I well, it happened a lot later, and I was like hanging out, and I was hammered watching life. Was, <laughs> does that count as a disqualifier? Well, I was hanging out watching Lifetime it later on. Lifetime? Yeah, that might have helped what? my uh, my my why up chuck reflex. But why are you I watching? Did, I did later on in the night. Why were you watching Lifetime? You know, the gobbler just put me in that mood. It just it just made me want to watch. I hate life. Idiot TV. <laughs> Were I felt there? suicidal is what I'm saying. Were you still hanging out with Alex? No, I was hanging out with Jim. Were you watching Lifetime together? Yes, that's what happened. With Alex? No, you see, Alex isn't there. That's why I said Alex wasn't there. Like, right, go on with the story. That's pretty much it. I was hanging out watching Lifetime. And, I said, up. and then I said, wow, I feel like shit because of that gobbler. And I, I went to my bathroom. Well, oh. <laughs> yeah, I didn't throw up, but I didn't feel good. It really attacked my stomach. I didn't... Go ahead. No, go ahead. I've been sick for two days. So, okay. It's good. I'm worried. That's good. No, it's not. I'm Maybe. worried. I'm worried this is going to take me back. I'm, I'm going back to the bad place. Uh, um, Mr. Santa Fe Grill, your gobbler is hurting people. It is, uh, <laughs> it is actually hurting. Kill that turkey! <laughs> your gobbler's hurting people, sir. Realize. Okay, so let's do a little. Uh, Dirt tortillas aren't very good. He he cooked them a lot. Like, like he had it on the grill and it got crispy. I like the sweet mm. tortillas on the grill. Yeah, they're mm -hmm. not very good. They're like they're not mission bad, but okay, let's rate these damn things. Oh. Ben, <laughs> what? I'll let you start <laughs> since you got two burritos to rate. Oh, some kind of badass. <laughs> I know. I haven't oh. eaten the guts of one burrito and he's finished two. I don't feel too good. Yeah, you're, you're gonna be running games tonight and it's not gonna go over well. <laughs> You all have to eat the shitty burrito. No! They make you do it. It's what you gotta do to travel through time. I hope it'll throw those up. <laughs> Dude, rate it before you throw I'm it up. I'm hoping you will, because then you will belong to a, a club. You have really select a club. A brotherhood. Of pusses. <laughs> Look at his eyes are all going whichever way. And yellow is the yellow side. He's got jaundice. <laughs> Your gobbler is giving jaundice. He looks like Peach's Valentine. <laughs> Okay, rating the gobbler. He's sweating, breaking. Oh, I know it's rough. That's not that hard, Ben. He's getting the sweats. I'll rate the gobbler as. I rating mine as a steaming pile of shit. <laughs> you can't. You can use that if you want. No, I think Alex used it. Mm. I'll rate it as. <laughs> <laughs> Appropriate. Now your dogs are eating a gobbler. <laughs> and they too will feel this pain. Cold chili. It wasn't very good to begin with. With congealed fat on top. Right. Ugh. Maybe with a bunch of salt in it, too. So it's like you... Salt. Oh, that's gross. So it's like if you ate a cold pile of shit. <laughs> I see we've come to the same place. Mm, the that's bad place. That's pretty much the only place you can eat the gobbler and come to. Ugh. Shit. Okay, so... The Green Mile. I'll rate the Green Mile as... A dream that you forget after you wake up. That's very appropriate. There you go. I just ate the Green Mile and the Gobbler, and I cannot remember what the Green Mile tasted like. But I can remember the Gobbler pretty well. But I, I'm kind of vaguely aware that I, I had a Green Mile. So you can remember you had a shitty sleep. But you can't remember what you dreamed in <laughs> What your sleep. dream was Maybe about. Maybe you shit in your sleep. That's what the Gobbler is. Shitting in your sleep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> And you wake up That's and you're like, awesome. oh, I just slept. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to rate uh, the Green Mile going to a kind of nice part of Mexico. It's probably going to be a pretty cheap vacation. Maybe a little bit spicy because you're in Mexico. <laughs> but other than that, it's just going to be okay. I'm going to... Uh. <laughs> What have I done? Let's go do crunch time. I'm going to rate the Green Mile... 15 seconds. Um, mediocre drunk food. Because in, in keeping with my tradition now, this is the second time I've pre-gamed Burrito Quest. I had like eight beers before I came here. And I like the Green Mile. 
But now that I think about the Green Mile, I'm like, eh, it's probably good because I'm drunk. Burrito Christ! We're here! Yeah. We'll see you next week when we tackle some other burrito. Does anybody know what it's called? Iron um, Man's? Is it the Iron Man? Uh, I thought we had something nah, nah, before nah. that. I hope it doesn't suck. That's really No, we have shitty burritos for the next two months. Yeah. Well, there's one in the middle. That Kid Dynamite looks all right. When do we Just because it's got a lot of... Bread. Spicy! Uh, next week, we will tackle the Iron Man. You're correct. What's in the Iron Man? Oh, we'll talk about that next time. Bye-bye, everybody! Bye.